She's a substance that breaks down molecules <laughs> for our brains. <laughs> This program to have is where I tutor CSEC and CAPE students with mathematics, CSEC mathematics and peer mathematics. So this came about when I realized that I have such a love for mathematics that I can impart the knowledge to somebody else. And also, when I was thinking about it, I was thinking about the community. The community is one of my inspirations in actually going to medical school and I wanted to do something that I can give back to them. I know that I don't really have any funds to give back now, but I can use my talents to give back. So I went and I talked to some of my church members and some of my families and they needed my help in mathematics so I used that, that platform to help them. And how has that been going? It has been going good. I've learned a lot from these young people. Um, sometimes it's hard to teach them mathematics but it's fun along the way. Sometimes I try to beat them but along the way it is, it is very fun to actually learn from them and to just know that you know I'm making an impact that's not only on myself but I'm making an impact on my community and you know I'm doing something that will make Jamaica a better place. So medical school is, is very very challenging as you said so to keep up um, during the week it's all medical school and i find that i don't necessarily have to make a lesson plan because with mathematics it's just mathematics is like a part of me so i just go there and i pick a topic and i will go there and i will just teach the student what i know so so i use so i don't really spend much time prepping for these classes because most of the stuff i know already and other times i'm just trying to make the best of medical school trying to make my parents proud the reason why I chose medicine, one of the re main reasons is because of my grandmother. When she um, she had cancer, she died. And while she was going through the treatments, I would be the one to travel with her to Kingston. And while there, I got to interact with some doctors, I got to interact with patients. And it, the atmosphere just felt right. It just felt like I belonged there. So I always liked the atmosphere at the hospital. Even though there are many sick persons there, I like the atmosphere that I can be there to, you know, just like how oh, I'm helping these kids, I'll be helping a lot more persons when they come to the, the hospital. So that is one of the reasons why I chose medicine. And I actually just like the profession. So um, with medicine, you're always learning. And that is one thing I love. I love to learn. So throughout my medical career, even when I'm, pra I'm a practicing doctor, I'll always be learning. I think that is one thing that I love about it, that I'll always learn new things. So Shana is not only my church sister, but my cousin. And uh, she helps me a lot, especially with the fact that at my school, they keep Saturday classes and I'm a Seventh-day Adventist. In classes, she she interacts with us and treats us not only as our students, but ha but as family in the sense that she uses different methods to get along with the topics that we may understand, practically in teen language, where we can fully... Oh, so, um... In school, you get the adult language, but when <laughs> Sasha and S teach she breaks, she breaks it down. down to the sense that, uh, let's say, she's a substance that breaks down molecules <laughs> for our brains. <laughs> I want others to use my example to, you know, go out there and volunteer. With this pandemic, we have a lot of persons that they can't get access to these online schools or they can't, you know, go to in that big classroom platform that they, you know, that they will learn so much in. So, you know, use your talent to use whatever you can to help others. And at the end of the day, maybe some of these kids will be there to help you help somebody else. So just go out there, do what you have to do for your community, for Jamaica, and just at the end of the day, make yourself proud.